your proposed successor to run this department, Pete Hegseth, has spoke, spoken and written extensively about women in combat, how women should not be in combat, and in his opinion are a detriment to US combat units. Um, what is your response to that? And broadly, what is your message to women in the military who feel that their service is being questioned? Well, you know, I, I don't know um, the, the, uh, the potential nominee, so I, I can't comment uh, on um, and won't comment on anything that, that he said. I don't know what his experiences are, but I can tell you about my experiences with women uh, in the military and women in combat, and they're pretty good. You know, and I was, I told a story earlier today where, you know, I was, uh, when I was a one star, I was a deputy commander of the 3rd Infantry Division. And you, you remember that 3rd Infantry Division was the major element that um, conducted the attack or the assault from Kuwait all the way up to, uh, to, to Baghdad and was very instrumental in, uh, in taking the city of Baghdad. Um, I, and I was the deputy commander for maneuver, so I was at the front edge of the battle. My goal was to be in a position where I could see and feel the fight. And so that meant that I had to be right there, you know, right behind the lead elements, and I was. In my headquarters, in my command post, were several very courageous and very proficient women who, who did amazing things to support uh, our effort and support uh, their colleagues. Uh, so. In, in, in my three tours, three long tours to Iraq and then one tour in, uh, in Afghanistan, uh, every place I went, there were women doing uh, incredible things. And, and, and they were adding value to, um, uh, to the overall effort, whether they were pilots, whether they were uh, operational experts, whether they were intel uh, experts. Uh, you know, I see things differently, and I see that because of my experience and that experience is extensive. Uh, and so I think our, our women uh, add significant value to the United States military. And we should never change that. And, and if I had a message to, to answer your question to, uh, to our women, I would say, I would tell them that, uh, you know, we need you. We, we, uh, we, we have faith in you. We, we are appreciative of, uh, of your service. And you add value to the, the, the finest and most lethal uh, fighting force on earth. Other than that, I haven't thought much about it. But. <laughs>